You're back in Fort Wayne for year two. Um, what does that feel like? It feels it feels good. It feels good and be back on uh, on the place that uh, you know uh, when I have you know, with not only me but as a team, you know, uh, organization. We just uh, have a great success last year. Um, different team this year, but uh, you know, a lot of a lot of hard um, young players. Um, I think our team this year is a lot better defensively. It's, I think we got a better de- uh, team than uh, last year because uh, we got more guys that at least they play uh, regular in one position. You know, so like last year we got a couple guys that was playing different position every day. But at least this year um, we got a pretty good team. You know, our pitching is going to be uh, outstanding this year again. So hopefully uh, uh, those guys just give us some uh, good innings and, and keep us close to the game. And hopefully our offense goes around. So. Uh, but uh, you know, it's going to be some times like last year, when uh, when the kids is going to go crazy and they're going to have a hard time. But uh, that's how young players are, you know. Uh, and they, and that's what we're here for, you know, to try and make those guys uh, teach them how to play the game better. And, and uh, so hopefully we don't go through a lot of hard times like last year, and, and uh, you know, be consistent all year round. How about the you know the starting pitching rotation you might have could have four first round draft picks in that. Uh, that's a lot of potential there. Yeah, um, it's the same thing. It's something that you have to be careful with those guys, you know. Um, it's a lot of money in those kids. Uh, and, uh, you know, this is going to be the first year for them when they have to be um, in the full season. So, um, like always, you know, we got some minimums in it for those guys. Um, we have to keep an eye on how many pitches they make, uh, four inning or four star. Uh, we're going to go this year for the beginning season on the six men's rotation. Uh, with the guy, with a lone man, every four days. So, uh, but we got some arm. We got some arm. Uh, something that uh, I think our pitching is kind of powered. You know, we got some power stuff. Uh, guys that are, you know, third, you know, 90 plus average. Um, it's about just go up there and, and play the game. You know, uh, try to be a better, try to get better player every day, and uh, just go there and try to work hard and, and see how and see how it goes. And then uh, working with two new guys on your staff this year too. How, how do you like that? Um, it, I like it. I like it. I didn't spend too much time with them this year in the spring training because uh, um, I went to I was participating with uh, Team Puerto Rico and WBC, so I didn't get to spend too much time with them. But they those guys was there early in the spring training at uh, mini camp, so I get to know them. Uh, but there are guys with uh, big league experience, you know. Bert Hooden is one of those guys that are uh, pitching the Worcester with the Dyer for a lot of years. Um, been in, been in the, and uh, minor league as a pitching coach, not only in this level but a higher level in Triple A. So he got the idea how to work with the with the with the young pitchers, and also Morgan Burkhart. You know, it's a guy that uh, uh, he was working independently last year, but a guy got some experience in the big league player too. So um, I feel fine. I feel great, and I feel happy with the staff that we have last year. Um, it's something that uh, we just got to put everything together, and and. I mean, just be ready to work with those guys and try to make those guys a better player every day.